now that I'm in NetSuite, let's navigate to the mobile app. We go to Setup, Custom, Mobile App. Now, one thing that's important to note is that any warehouse operator will have a tablet that has this app automatically loaded to the home screen, and they will not need to navigate the same way that we did just there. But today, in packing, we'll go through the pack station. I'll then have to select my warehouse again. Again, this is a list of all the warehouses that I have access to. Let's go to the San Francisco location. Now I can pack the sales order or transfer order. Let's look at sales orders. Here you can see I have the San Francisco staging location, with ten, which has 10 sales orders currently located there, with a total, total item count of 1,262. I can, collect on the, I can click on that bin, and I can see a list of all the sales orders that are at this packing station. Let's go ahead and pick one of these, or pack one of these sales orders. It'll tell me to scan slash enter the pick carton or item number. NetSuite will automatically give me a, net, a carton number by taking the sales order and then give me dash one, dash two, dash three, or whatever carton number that it may be. This is the first carton in this order that we're packing, so you can see sales order 338-1. I could click print label here. However, I currently don't have it set up to a printer. Um, just as an example, if you get a, a label to print out something that looks similar to this, obviously there can be different customizations based on whatever you need your labels to do. But here's just a good example of what it may look like. Now I'll add my carton. As you can see, this carton is open. I can pack into here by selecting pack and it'll ask me what quantity I'd like to pack. Here I'll pack eight. It'll ask me to scan the serial number. And I can select which serial number this item is. Five, six, seven, eight. I'll have to do this for all eight serial numbers. And I can now pack the carton because all items are in here. By packing the carton, I'll have to select a carton weight. I can change the unit size to pounds, kilograms, ounces, whatever is needed. I can also select a carton size. One of the interesting features with NetSuite is this carton weight. Now, as you can see, I just manually put in the weight. However, they do have scales where you can automatically weigh it and the weight will, will update automatically right into NetSuite. I can then pack the carton. You can now see, based off of this logo right here, the tape is fully covering the box, which means that I should have now packed the box. From there, I can click Next, and I can either go to staging, or I can add it to a pallet. The pallet process is very similar as before. It's gonna auto-generate a pallet number for me. I'm gonna select a pallet size, and I'm gonna add it to the pallet. Here it shows me packing it onto the pallet. I can go next and I can submit this packed order. Now you'll see I'm back in the queue and I'm ready to pack the next order. 